Hi, my name is Talia Nasi, and I'm a senior developer advocate here at AWS Serverless. This video is about Amazon DynamoDB use cases by industry. Customer use cases for Amazon DynamoDB span across multiple industries. Banks and financial institutions can use DynamoDB to detect fraud and suspicious user transactions. Banks can use it for supporting mobile applications as well as for mainframe offloading. In the gaming industry, DynamoDB can be used for storing game states, leaderboards, and player data stores. Software companies use DynamoDB for metadata caches and data stores. Ad tech companies use DynamoDB to store various kinds of marketing data, such as user profiles, user events, clicks, and visited links. Some of these include real-time bidding, ad targeting, and attribution. Retail sites like Amazon.com use DynamoDB for their shopping carts and workflow engines. Media and entertainment companies use DynamoDB for user data stores and media metadata stores. Let's dive deeper into some of the key use cases where DynamoDB is an excellent fit. DynamoDB supports multiple high-traffic sites and systems here at Amazon, including Alexa, the Amazon.com sites, and 442 Amazon Fulfillment Centers. Across the 66-hour 2020 Prime Day, these sources made 16.4 trillion calls to the Amazon DynamoDB API, peaking at 80.1 million requests per second. Amazon.com supports hundreds of millions of active workflows. We migrated from Oracle to DynamoDB and noticed a few benefits along the way. First, we had improved customer experience because our workflow processing delays dropped from one second to 100 milliseconds. Our infrastructure costs were reduced because our scaling and maintenance effort were dropped 10 times. And we reduced complexity and risk in our system by retiring more than 300 Oracle hosts. We're also seeing a big swing in customers looking to move Cassandra-based workloads to DynamoDB. It makes sense because the two are similar. We routinely hear from CTOs who say that things started well on Cassandra, but managing at scale is costly and complex. It's particularly difficult to find the expertise to support Cassandra. Samsung used to have a number of people maintaining a Cassandra cluster. After migrating to DynamoDB, those people now focus on the mobile app and not on the database. We're also seeing customers looking to move their mainframe workloads to DynamoDB. Financial customers such as Capital One are benefiting from moving to a flexible and highly scalable database like DynamoDB that's integrated into their serverless architecture on AWS, and they were able to focus on building faster applications with reduced latency for better user experience. In 2020, Capital One completed migration from all of their data centers to AWS, becoming the first U.S. bank to go all in on the cloud. Disney Plus, one of the largest global online video streaming platforms, was launched in November 2019 as the home of Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars, and National Geographic. DynamoDB is one of the technologies that supports their massive global footprint. DynamoDB helps with utilizing multi-region replication with single-digit latency that allows Disney Plus to shift traffic without experiencing data issues. We also added another AWS region in Global Tables as Disney Plus launched into new countries, which provided them with low latency. DynamoDB also helped Disney Plus with scaling recommendations and bookmarks with little to no operational overhead. Siemens Gas & Power uses AWS to reduce power plant alerts by 90%. Siemens used AWS Lambda for analyzing power plant process control data, Amazon S3 for object storage, Amazon SQS for fully managed message queuing, and DynamoDB to hold the results of analytics processes that run based on data held in Amazon S3. This provided them with the ability to prototype the serverless platform and application in three months, reduce customers' alerts by 90%, and reduce infrastructure costs by 85% with no downtime in the first year. Lyft chose DynamoDB to handle massive scale and bursts gracefully. Lyft is in more than 200 cities, there's over 14 million rides per month, and eight times the traffic during peak hours. For mission-critical transactional data, the GPS location of all rides is tracked in the Ride Location Tracking System. Lastly, to handle rapid growth cycles with a small team, Lyft's deployed their, their Location Tracking System on DynamoDB. In this video, you learned about common DynamoDB use cases by industry. 
To learn more about DynamoDB, head to serverlessland.com where you'll find more content from me and my team. I'm Talia Nasi. Thanks for tuning in.